What's up everyone, got a creation here. And today we are looking at a little device, well not really little, but a kind of kind of semi big device that I call the price increaser in Minecraft. So how this works is I have to press this command block button right here. Okay. Now when I set now when I press this button, it will then activate that. And I should have automatically we went. That's not good. Wait. Oop. I've got some work to do. Alright, I'm sorry about that. Um, okay, so what looks like is players set CS0. Okay. So, where was I? Okay. So, when I press this button, it's going to. Oops. It's gonna activate this, so it's not supposed to happen. Why isn't it doing what it's supposed to do? Alright, so there's a couple flaws with this system no matter what I try, so I guess I can explain what's supposed to happen. So this command block increases a command called a scoreboard called buy by one. Uh this is a command block that's searching for that particular uh, command, which is then being sent into this, maybe that's what's wrong with it, let's try doing that. Um, so here's what happens, so this redstone wire is cooked up to this command block, which will turn the buy back to zero, which will then deactivate this command block, will actually make the repeater go off. So what else is happening here? Uh, well, then we have this AND gate, which is only activatable when this repeater is on and this wire is on. So, not only that, it's hooked up to this redstone circuit, so it can only happen once, then it'll activate to the next rank, and then we got a three-way, which means this can only be activated when all three torches are off, and so on and so forth. Uh, and then to keep the redstone from going out and doing what it shouldn't, this is these repeaters are here to stop it. I don't know why it's um, it's not working like it should. I don't know, but uh, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.